location of Lima has led to many environmental injustices for its lower socioeconomic classes. As the city continues along a trajectory of rapid growth, urban poverty increases along with a lack of access to safe and sufficient water flows and circulations needed to meet the three sustainability goals, economic growth and efficiency, environmental protection, and social and political justice. Economic growth and efficiency is argued to be the primary issue of concern, considering widespread poverty can be abolished by conquering this goal. While the land is being exploited for economic gain, the conditions of the environment and of the poor are not improving. The goal of justice seems to be overlooked. Lima's government leaves the poor to build their own houses on the city outskirts, resulting in makeshift slums around Lima. Situated in the desert, these poorly built houses leave the lower socioeconomic classes to face environmental injustices related to the flows and circulations of water in and out of the city. In these areas, there is a lack of safe and sufficient water supply, sanitation, and drainage. Available drinking water comes from the Rimac River, which is highly contaminated, and much of the clean drinking water produced is lost due to leakage and mismanagement. One million people do not have access to safe drinking water, close to two million people are not connected to the sewer system, and over three million people depend on groundwater from contaminated wells. Many citizens' water supplies are trucked in every week and used for household needs such as drinking, cooking, bathing, and washing clothes. Citizens are unaware of where their water comes from and explain that the water is dirty with a brownish color and sometimes contains worms. As a result of using this water, many people have constant diarrhea and are taken to the hospital for treatment, considering diarrhea leads to 1.8 million child deaths per year. As the population will continue to increase in the desert city, the presence of fresh, clean water will become impossible to find, leaving the lower socioeconomic classes in risk of being affected by water-related diseases, which is one of the leading causes of deaths worldwide. Considering the flows and circulations of water in this city were ignored for decades, it will take a considerable amount of time to change the metabolism of Lima, Peru and fix the environmental injustices placed on the lower socioeconomic classes.